Hi friends, today I am going to perform a very interesting experiment for generating electricity from mud. This can be used to power light loads like LED bulbs and clocks. Welcome to science for you. If you find this video interesting, please do not forget to subscribe to this channel. For this project, we need to make electric cells with mud as the electrolyte. For this electric cell, we need to have an anode, which is the positive terminal and cathode, which is the negative terminal. The anode and cathode for this cell can be taken from old batteries. The carbon rod from the battery can be used as the anode or the positive terminal, and the zinc plate can be used as the cathode, or the negative terminal. I will now show you how to take the carbon rod and zinc plate from old batteries. First, we have to remove the outer plastic covering of the battery. After removing the plastic cover, what you see is the zinc plate which is the cathode in the battery. The zinc plate can be cut and taken out from the battery. This is the zinc plate. What you see now in black color is the electrolyte in the battery. After removing the zinc plate, the electrolyte in the battery can be removed and we can get the carbon rod. In the same way, take out the zinc plate and the carbon rods from four numbers of old batteries. Now, we have to clean all the four zinc plates and the carbon rods. The cleaning is completed now. It is time to collect some mud for this battery. You can add water to earth and make some mud from it. I have done like that. The mud, which is the electrolyte for this battery is ready. Now, we will try making a single cell with this mud. Take a glass and fill mud in it, till it is full.
Now, we have to insert the zinc plate and the carbon rod into this mud. Connect electrical wire to the carbon rod and the zinc plate. Now, let us check how much voltage the single cell made of mud can produce. The single cell is producing 1.162 volts. Let us make four more cells like this, which will give a higher output voltage required for powering LED bulbs. Now, we have to connect all four cells together. The anode of one cell is to be connected to the cathode of the next cell. The battery with four cells, made of mud is ready. The four cells combined produces a voltage output of 4.585 volts. It is time to do the testing. The battery made of mud easily powers LED bulbs. I have even connected an LED array of 30 bulbs and this battery is powerful enough to light up all the bulbs. If you have liked the video, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel to watch more interesting experiment and DIY projects in future. Thank you.